Okay, and welcome back to Scarface. World is yours. So now, ooh, well, actually, you know what? I can probably sell to this drug dealer over. Hey. You won't be so proud of me, Gina. Wait. I didn't even know you could just randomly intimidate people. Oh. You smart time, man. Who the fuck do you think you are? First time I fucked that up. You sleep well tonight, Paco. Everybody gonna know the name of Tony Montana. Okay. Well, that's first. <laughs> you dirty fuck. Were you trying to touch my ass? You gotta make your own they luck, They should really Chico. clean things up around here. And they should start with you. Okay. The thing is... Hey, get the fuck out of my face. Exactly. I'm sorry, Mr. Montana. I didn't mean anything by it. Yeah, you did. <laughs> so you gotta do a sneer, just pss. I got me some. And it's gonna make you happy, okay? Here. It's the best shit in town. Twenty G's, Twitter. Keep up the good work, man. Okay? I see you again soon. I take out your cheap fuck. Cheap. Anything I need. Man. Don't make me blow your brains out. I got a bullet for you. Next time you die. Now, time to go talk to the guy from Pedro's pawn shop. Oh shoot. Well, pause. Yeah, we're gonna listen to music. The bad oh, yeah. success. We're gonna play that. Don't throw a duck, man. Okay, I'd love to find the Diaz brothers. Uh, I guess we're just not about to find them today. I thought we was going to have one of those, but let's talk to the gun dealer. Ooh, everything is kind of out of my price range. Oh, bye-bye. Here's the door. Now, I don't particularly like this mission because, basically... Oh, wait. Hold on. Pedro Spawn Shop. Every last one. It always does that. I think you gotta pay like 10 G's for him. But Big Real Spot Shop. I want what's coming to me. ¿Qué pasa, man? I heard you trying to sell this place. How about I pay you in cash? You work for me, and we go straight to the top. How do you like that? Sounds fucking great. But the cops, one of my contacts told me they're coming to check up. They find all these hot goods to shut me down. I got to go get rid of them right away. Oh yeah, you gotta deliver some stuff for him. First crate is loaded in Pedro's van. Get it out of here. Ditch three loads without getting the cops' attention. And you got five minutes. <laughs> it's not really hard though. But <clears throat> for me, because of my horrible, horrible No. Due to my horrible, horrible. Oops. But due to my horrible, horrible driving. Oops. I'm wasting time. I hate wasting time. How the fly frick? Get out the way! Oh, ooh, ooh. I almost forgot about that. Oh, yeah. That was the worst part. You have to go back. I forgot all about that crap. You have to go back to the, uh, 
pawn shop to get the uh, the drugs or package. Mind you, you also have to keep this particular van in good condition. Now, my thing is, couldn't we just like drop it at Tony's house? First off, why can't we load all the vans in here? I mean, all the boxes at once. Second, why can't we just drop them all off at Tony's mansion? I'm pretty sure they're much uh, it's quicker to get to Tony's mansion than it is to go all the way around the town. Come on, get out the way. So we got just under half the time. I'm probably gonna fail this because you literally have to do it perfectly. If it's not done perfectly, nine times out of ten, you're gonna fail. Shut up. But like I said, it, that's likely what's gonna end up happening. If I don't do, it, if you don't do it perfectly, you're gonna mess up, mess up, and you're probably gonna fail. Cause I have less than two minutes to deliver. I actually think deliver and get back to my next target, and I'm pretty sure the next place is halfway across the the bloody map. So, see, my driving ain't helping either. Cause, nope, this mission has failed. Already know I failed it. Oh, yeah. I remember now. They arrived early. So you have to outrun the cops. <laughs> Without destroying the van. Not too difficult. I, I'm not even going to lie. It's not too difficult. I was remembering this particular mission kind of uh, differently. Fudge. It's not helping. This car is going to blow up. This is what happens every time. See? And this ain't doing the age of quick restarts either. It's do this mission over from the beginning. Yeah. Trust me. <laughs> this mission gets really annoying at times. What the fuck am I doing? Come on, come on. Come on, let me skip. We're not listening to you. We're going to get into this van. I already know it's loaded in pages. Come on. Oh, okay. I didn't know that was a handbrake. Bing, bing, bing. No, no, no. Shut up. I don't want to hear that. But, but yeah, hopefully we can get it on time this time because, see, trying to do this. Uh, what's the word? Trying to do this without what's the word without screwing up it's kind of difficult but it's not too impossible and I wish you didn't have to use his van but other than that it's, it's not too horrible of a mission anyway uh, I was gonna oh yeah fallout Fallout 4. Now, I, I, I figured I should mention this. 
that this is going to be like this for a while because I really am waiting for Fallout 4. But I can't wait for Fallout 4. I was watching some uh, videos of Fallout 4. Man, everything just looks so great. I can't wait till November. And by the I, I promise, I promise that I will be recording Fallout 4 for you. Day one release. This is my promise. This is my promise to you guys. Day one release. Now, nine times out of ten, I need to go. I really should repair this vehicle. Because the problem is, I'm gonna have the police shooting at me. And this vehicle is almost halfway destroyed. And unlike a lot of games, shooting anything does damage. I mean, even though it's only a little bit of damage. It was a car in front of me. Wow. But yeah, I will be recording it day one. I'm also going to start recording Assassin's Creed Unity Fallout 4. Not Fallout 4, Far Cry 4. Uh, Shadow of Mortal, Watch Dogs, and eventually Mortal Kombat and a couple of other games. But as of right now, those are the ones that are on the list. Cops arrived early, blah, blah, blah. Now, the thing is, police can easily outrun me. But luckily, no, I was cheated. And I was kind of saved. I want to just shoot them, but I know I shouldn't. Okay, ditch the last one. I just hate the fact that this particular um, one is all the way out in Bufu, Egypt. But other than that, it's not too bad. I think it's at the trailer park. But, uh, yeah, those are the games I intend to record. Hopefully everything works out right outside the trailer park. Okay. Come. Come on. Wait. It's I oh 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 that would have been horrible. But I refuse. I refuse to have this car two thousand. Uh, a thousand, oh god, I can't add now. A thousand, but I refuse to leave the van, blow the van up, and then I, because I don't remember. But, uh, we're gonna make our way back to Patriots, and, 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 mind you, it costs $10,000, I think, to buy Pedro's pawn shop. 10000 But, I guess it could be worse. Oops, uh. but, ooh, dang it, I was hoping that was another car, get out of my way, get out of my way, Ch -ch -ch -ch. I do like the ambient music in this game as well, oh, that just reminded me, Bloodborne, Bloodborne, I do want to record Bloodborne and Lords of the Fallen, but that is easier said than done, because all the stuff that I paid, I bought off eBay, for like, Ten dollars. I mean, twenty dollars each game. No, it was no. Actually, Shadow of Mordor was twenty-five, but everything else was twenty or less. Uh, so I don't really know how everything is going to work. But hopefully soon, I'll be able to record that.
I took care of your chip, man. The cops won't find anything now. Holy fucking shit, thanks, Tony. Coño, I'm looking forward to working with you, man. And with the end of this mission, hopefully you guys enjoyed it. If you did, leave a like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you guys in the next video.